or a dumbbell, whatever you got, and room to go overhead because we are going overhead today. All right, so we're going to start with joint mobility. So let's start with the chin to the chest, up to the ceiling, up and down. How you doing, Steve? Good, you? Good. Steve, you, do, you won't be able to make fun of me as much because I'm not leading at this time. Hopefully you have some uh, notes. The whiteboard goes away. I like Luke. Oh, yeah. I know. It'll probably be like, Luke is the best. We'll go right here. Colin right sucks. Shoulder. Stuff left like that. Side to side. And the other crazy thing, Stephen, is I don't actually know how to mute you on here, so I'm a little nervous right now. Good. You should be. I'll, I'll <laughs> mute him, Paul. I'll, I'll self-mute. You've been waiting to mute Stephen for a long time. A baby. Long time. <laughs> And then from there, we'll go next circles, five in one direction, nice and slow. The reason you guys are working out with Luke today, not me, is we're doing, it's a one-armed workout. Yes. One arm only. <laughs> one arm. Girl, one side, guys. one arm. And then five in the opposite direction. How do I mute everybody? Yeah. Uh, participants. Oh. Gotcha. Thank you. And then mute. Thank you. And from there, hands on the quad, shrug the shoulders up and roll them down the back. Thanks. And then if you need to pin, just click on the right. Oh, yeah, let me corner. pin you. Okay, got it. And then you're going to roll them forward. Yeah, I don't, I'm learning my way here. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll go both arms, bring them forward, big arm circles. It's actually harder to operate this thing than it is to coach, I think. <laughs> I know, look at those arms. Yeah. And then put it in reverse. One's a little bit more mobile than the other, but it's in there. And then from there, we'll go right arm, one and a half forward, one and a half backwards. No, I'm not going to show that one. <laughs> and I want you guys to get switch it up on your other arm. So left arm, one and a half forward, one and a half backwards. Nice job. And then we'll go one palm up, one palm down. Rotate the shoulder to the ceiling. Rip. <laughs> nice job. And then let the arm thing and pivot side to side. Exhale as you turn. And then we'll go hands on the hips. Big hip circles. I'll zoom in for you. There's no Terry here today to zoom in on. And then put it in reverse, opposite direction. And then from there, feet together. You guys are going to exhale down to the left side. Sweep the hands across the front and stand up. So five on the left. Exhale down. Once you have five on the left, we're going to go five on the right. So big exhale down to the right side and then stand up. How you doing, Catherine? Tim, are you in camo today? It looks like Can't not. Tell. Oh, okay, good. Nice. And then from there, we're going to go prayer squat. So weight in the heels, elbows inside the knees, open up the hips in the bottom, and then stand up. We're going to go 30 seconds. Nice deep squat. So one more deep squat. Fry the knees open in the bottom. And then once you guys are good there, we're gonna bring it down to the floor. So lying flat on your back. We're gonna go straight right leg, pull your toes back, give me 10 leg kicks on the right. Loosen up the hammies. And then once you got 10 on the right, you're going to go 10 on the left. We'll all be able to do this together next week. What, just stretching the hips and hamstrings? Yeah, partner stretches. <laughs> What you yes. got 10. 10 on the opposite leg, you're going to walk the heels into the backside, bridge the hips up, hold for a two count, 
and then slowly lower down. We're going to go five hip bridges. If anyone does make gifts, this would be an ideal one to make a gift of Luke. <laughs> Matt Allen's not on there this morning, so I think I'm safe. Is Sam on here? Maybe. And then once you got five, you're going to bring the knees into the chest, tee the arms out, palms flat on the floor. Drop the knees to the right, look to your left. Stretch that lower back, open the chest and shoulders, back to center, and then switch sides. Good, then from there we're gonna bring our feet back down to the floor. You're gonna cross your left foot over your right knee, grab behind that right knee, pull back, drive the left knee out. Hang out, shift the outside of that hip. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. And then bring the feet back to the floor. You're going to go right foot over your left knee. Pull back behind that left knee. Relax that head back down to the floor. Good. And then from there, we'll flip it over. And we will finish with Spider-Man stretch. So from a plank, take a big step outside the hands. Rotate that hand to the ceiling. And then you're going to switch sides. We're going to go three per side on the Spider-Man stretch. And once you guys have three and three, you can shake it out, grab a drink of water. And we will show you your every three for 15. So three and three, then shake it out, grab a drink, and grab a dumbbell or a kettlebell. Ridiculously heavy one. Or whatever you got. Or just whatever you have. Yeah. <laughs> I know Luke's promised a demo with the super heavy one today. Only on the right side. <laughs> Everybody warmed up? Any questions, comments? Here, I'm unmuting you guys. I unmuted everybody. Anybody have any questions, comments, concerns before we talk about the full workout? Grievances we'd like to air. Steve? Steve no. has a grievance. Nothing. Oh, I'm, happy. I'm happy you're doing it, Luke. That's all that matters. I, yes, way better. <laughs> The nine names have already gotten better. All right, I'm gonna mute guys. You got a coffee? Who's oh, drinking? Yep. Yeah. Laura's drinking coffee. Nice. All right, I'm gonna mute you guys. We're gonna talk about the workout. Yeah, I'll have Colin explain and I will demo. So today we have two 15 or two complexes. You're gonna do four exercises, five reps on one side, five reps each on the other side, and then you're gonna plank out until the two minute mark. And we're gonna go every every three minutes for 15 minutes total. Um, so it'll be five rounds total. So Luke, if you can see him here, he's going to do five one-arm swings. Once he has five of those, he's going to rip into five snatches overhead. So all the way down, lower it, save his hands. From here, he's going to go five push press. So he goes, connects his arm to his body, dips, bumps it overhead, and then five reverse lunges. So he steps back, touches his knee to the floor lightly, like a grandma kissed the ground and stands up. Once he has five, he's going to switch hands. So he switches and he goes five, 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 five on the other side. So swings, snatches, push press, lunges on the other side. And then he's going to hit the deck and he's going to catch his breath with a relaxing plank position. So he'll do this for till he, we hit the two minute mark. Um, and then you'll rest a full minute and we're going to go every three minutes for 15 minutes total. So once again, it's five swings, five snatches, five push press, five lunges, switch hands, five, 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 and then a plank out followed by a minute rest, five rounds total. Oh, are you tired already? Warm. Warm. Feeling good? Yep. Good. You need water? No, nope, you're good. Okay. Are we, is everybody ready? This is Luke's first demo day. He's going to crush it, going in 10. I didn't even know this was happening, but I'm so excited. Here we go. Get ready in five, three, two, and you're going to hike the kettlebell back. Pull the bell high to your thigh. Your butt goes back. Your shins stay vertical. Control your breathing. So as you come up with the bell, you're going to exhale. Then you're going five snatches. So rip overhead. Good job. Lower to your shoulder so you don't rip your beautiful hands. Once you have five snatches, you're going to connect your arm to your body, and you're going to bump it with your legs. So baby squat, bump five times. Make sure you stick it on top for a sec. Once you have five, step back five times. We should, we're about 30 seconds in. Should be lunging right now. So lightly touch your knee to the ground. There we go, good job. Big step back, front shin's vertical. The knee gives the grandma a kiss to the ground, and then you switch hands. So switch on the other side, and Luke's not gonna demo on that side. Yep, so you don't even have to. So it's five swings, then five snatches on the other side. 
then five push press. Nice job, Sadie. Then five lunges. As soon as you finish, right now we're a minute in. So you've got two minutes to finish. You don't need to speed through. Make all your form beautiful. So stick the lockout, five lunges. And then you're going to plank out to the two-minute mark. So you should get about 30 seconds, 40 seconds of planks. Unless you're rifling through this thing. And then, so once you finish, hit the deck and relax. So you're going to pull your hands under your shoulders. You're in a plank position. If you want to add that flare, spice, hardness to it, you can do your own variations of planks. But we've got 30 seconds left. So abs are tight. Glutes are tight. Quads are tight. Everything's tight. And you're just planking out, catching your breath. Drop your knees if you need to for plank. Exactly. Yeah, if you're dying, drop to your knees. If you're not dying, add some hard hardness to it. Do a walkout around the world. we got 10 seconds, and then you're going to catch your breath. You're going to grab a breakfast sandwich, coffee, five seconds, or for Steven, a beer, three, two, and shake it out, guys. Good job. That's one round done. Breakfast sandwich and a beer. How'd that round sound? It's good. Feel good. Shake it out in 50 seconds. We're going to do round two. So it's every three for 15, five times through total. How are we feeling? Chelsea, you feeling good today? Good. Double thumbs up. Good. Nice. Sadie crushing it. Where is Sadie? Sadie is crushing it today. I think Pam is having trouble keeping up with Sadie. Good job, Sadie. 20, 20 seconds. 20 We're seconds. going. <laughs> going again. Good job, Sadie. Get ready for round two, girl. Okay, in 15. So we're going one arm swings from the top, all up one side, down the other side. Going in seven. So get ready. Three, two, and go. Pull the bell high to your thigh. Exhale. Try to shoot it sternum height. Your other arm, notice how Coach Luke shadowing with his other hand. So don't keep your arm stationary. Once you have five of those, though, you're going to rip it overhead. I'd lower it down to your shoulder. Hike it back, and if you're using a dumbbell, we'll do a dumbbell round two and show you. Um, once you have five snatches, though, it's going to be, yep, there you go. So he's showing the dumbbell version, five push press. On the dumbbell version of this, you connect the corner of the dumbbell to your shoulder, and then still same motion, you just dip and drive. It's all about that connection to your torso. From there, five big steps back, back knee lightly touches. If you have grandma knees, you could do a big step with a little knee bend, too. We show what, like a show it. Show a bum knee. What? There you go. So less bend in the knee. Once you have five, switch it up. Switch hands. And then it's five swings, five snatches, five push press, five lunges, followed by a plank out. Right now, we are one minute in. Keep breathing. Get that rhythm with your breath. Keep rocking. Nice job. Nice job. Go, Laura. Nice, Chelsea. Planks coming up. So switch hands, then plank out. Laura's drinking coffee throughout the whole complex. She hasn't it, put her coffee it, cup down coffee, once. Though? It's coffee and Bailey's, I believe. Nice. Good. Yes, Irish coffee. Maxine is also drinking Irish coffee. Right, Jackie? Good job. So we're, plank <laughs> we're planking out. Keep rocking. Right now, you've got... Let's go, Amanda. About 20 seconds. I can't see anything but Amanda's hand. I know Tim is laying down. Oh, she's waving. 10 seconds. Nice, Tim. Tim's got both arms out and both legs out in this plank. That's how advanced he is. Five seconds. Stick with us. Four, three, two, and shake it out. Nice job. Two rounds done. Shake out, shake it out, shake it out. Two rounds. Nice job, everybody. So in about 50 seconds, we are rocking out round three of five. Get excited. This could be your best round. Patty. How are you? Outdoor workout. It's Patty mixing it up. Yeah. Nice. How are the flies today? No, no mosquitoes, black flies today. That's good. 20 seconds. <laughs> I see, a, I see a posting there with Steve. Better capture that. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I actually blocked out Steven's screen. Where is he? There he is. Wow. Let me oh. pin this. Wow. That, 
I already, I told you that. That one stings. I, that hurts bad. I'm leaving. Cut. Going in five. <laughs> Everyone is doing a good job except for Steven. Get ready. <laughs> Here we go. Five swings. Shadow with that other hand. Pull the bell high to your thigh. So your forearm comes right up to your groin. Your butt goes back. Then you're going to rip it for five snatches. Rip it. Good job. Once you have your five snatches, remember we're not, we're not speeding through at the expense of form, so you still have plenty of time to stick it. All you're rushing into is a plank. So stick the form. 30 seconds. I know some of the coaches do this. They will take so long if they do zero planks because their form is so deliberate. Good job. <laughs> that when I do it, I do it that way. <laughs> I go one second to plank. Switch hands. Switch hands when you get your five lunges, five swings, five snatches, five push press. Five lunges, and then you're going to plank it out. We are about a minute in. You guys are crushing it, especially Sadie. I wonder if the Parsons are synchronized today. They have to be. Wow. Yep. You guys have this down to a science. It's automatic. Totally synchronized. We've never seen this, anything like this. I will say keep, keep on crushing. Nice job. Once you finish, you're going to hit the deck and relax. Wendy, how are we feeling Wendy. today? Wendy's so happy today. This is the happiest I've ever seen her. Good job. Must be sore after Murph. Wendy did a triple Murph yesterday. I'm surprised she can still walk. Good job, good job. So you're planking out. Ruth. Whoa, Ruth is on here? She is. Ruth, good morning. Let's go, Rebecca. We're Hi, planking Catherine. it out, planking it Hi, out. Catherine. We've got 15 seconds. Stick with it. You've all disappeared because you're holding planks. Or you all are leaving, leaving the workout. Good. Someone. Oh, we see your hand, Rebecca. Oh, we see Dr. B's hand. And got it. Good job. Shake it out. Three deep. You're more than halfway. You're at the more than halfway mark. Did you think they would make it this far? Uh, I think it maybe halfway through the first round. <laughs> but halfway through the second round, is a different story. Yeah. Right now we got round four coming up. The good news is this is the easy complex and we're doing the hard complex next. I'm just kidding. I don't know. It's the second half of your half Murph. Yes. It's, for anyone that skipped Murph yesterday, we're doing Murph in the second half. You guys got 20 seconds. What's up, Olivia? 20, Olivia and Rory, how are we doing? I will say I'm not glad I'm not demoing because going overhead right now does not feel <laughs> that great. Lats a little tight. Lats are ridiculously sore. I probably have rhabdo. <laughs> Get ready. We got five seconds. Five seconds. Get ready. Here we go. Three, two, and go. Oh, a few of you had a false start, and that's a five burpee penalty. Good job. Five swings. Once you have five, we're going five snatches. So rip it overhead. Good job. Once you have five snatches, you're gonna rock out five push press. So connect your arm to your body and bump it with your legs. So use those legs because we have plenty more to do. Right now, you are 30 seconds in. You have a lot of time. From there, big step back into a lunge position. Lightly touch. Down. Yep. Chest up. So keep that, the bell that you're holding your dumbbell with, kettlebell, pull that elbow down. Once you have your lunges, switch hands. Don't go overhead with that hand. Good job, five swings, five snatches, five push press. And then you're gonna relax with a plank. Catch your breath. Good job, everybody. 10 minutes in, so you're, you're one minute down officially. Get your five, 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 and then relax with a plank. Good job, everybody. Got about 40 seconds, 40 seconds. How are we doing? Stick with it. Nice job, Jackie. Good job, good job, good job. Let's go, Tim. Tim's crushing it. Nice, man. Let's go, Amanda. Nice job. Good job, Catherine. Wendy's hiding. I can't see her anymore. How's Michelle D doing? Right now we've got 15. Yeah, hi, Michelle. Nice. 
Other people give us the bird from down there, but you give a nice friendly wave, Michelle. Thank you. Kevin, how you doing, man? We got, oh, done. Shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Good job. Four deep. Catch your breath, you got a minute. If you've been hiding a rusty 80 pound kettlebell in your basement or dumbbell, now's the time to get it. Yep, pull it out of the basement and rip it for round five. How? I think Kate left. She's not there anymore. 30 seconds. Oh, you came back, Kate. I thought you were on your hammock. It's not sunny enough for it today. You guys got 30 seconds. Last one coming up. Last round. I'm issuing a challenge to the Constances. Can they do round five totally synchronized? We're going to test their marriage right now. Totally synchronized. Test their commitment. Here we go, Steven. There's a lot of pressure on you. He grabbed the 80 pound kettlebell. Going in five. Totally synchronized, Stacy. Like synchronized swimmers. Time starts now. Here we go. Yes, uh, they're almost synchronized. Here we, Steven is not even trying. There we go. Good job. Now five snatches. Yes, they're synchronized. Never seen the Costas's move like this before. It's because Stacy's keeping pace. Stacy's got him under control. She muted him. Here, oh, we lost it. Oh, no. Oh, bummer. Here, yeah. <laughs> Good job. Good job nice. Got it back. Dialed it back in. Five lunges. This will be the hardest part. Because Steven doesn't believe in lunges. Good job. Neither one of you believe. Constances do not believe in lunges. Good job. Once you have five, switch hands. Guys, nice work. Almost as good as the Parsons. But they've been synchronized without even trying. Look at that. There we go. Shadow the swing with the other hand. So shadow with the other hand. Five swings on the other side. Five snatches. Five push press. And then her last set of planks. How's Tim doing? Go, Tim. Tim doesn't have any visitors. He got tired of his daughter out lifting him uh, every, every workout. So we asked her not to work out with him. Get the volume down so no one knows he's working out. Yep, he's hiding in his garage. Good job. We're planking out as you finish. We've got 40 nice seconds. Amanda. Good job, everybody. Go, Wendy. Come on, Tim. Almost made it. Rebecca almost made it. Amanda. The last 30 seconds. Amanda's going to be sad if she doesn't get at least 30 seconds of planks. Super sad. Shake, keep going, keep going. We got 15 seconds. Good job. 10 Super. seconds. Stick with us. Job, Maxine. Eight. Who's killing it more, Maxine or Jackie? It's hard to tell. Good job. Three, yeah. two, and got it. Good job, everybody. One done. One down. Rest. Hello, Maxine. Shake it out. <laughs> shake it out. Shake it out. Luke, are we done? Uh, we're halfway done. Halfway there. It's a halftime show. I knew you guys could make it through that round. So grab a drink. Shake it out. We're going to talk about round two. It's extra special. I got to go. Got to adjust my camera angle. Hello. Yep. So round two, same exact format, but four different exercises. Actually, five different exercises. So this round, we're going to do five stand deadlifts, 1.5 deadlifts. So you line up your heel and toe, stick your booty back, and crack a walnut on top for five. From there, kick back, and you're going to do five rows. Use your lats. Exhale on top. Five. No twerking up these rows, so pause on top for a second. From there, he brings his back foot up. Bell in between his heels, and he rips it from the ground. Five, dead clean. So the bell touches the ground every time. Once he has five of those, he takes a deep squat and fires it overhead. Nice. I got to catch. Yes, look at that. I'm moving the camera with the squat. Oh, That's fancy room. camera man -ship, if That's a word. Good job. Once he finishes both sides of that, he is going to sit on his booty, and he's going to rock out, chin grab, sit up. So his heels extend. Shoulders touch, and he gives big hugs to his shins. And we're going to do this until the two-minute mark. So same format, four different exercises, and shin grabs instead of planks. I'm going to unmute you. I don't know if I should or not, but you're all unmuted. Does anyone have any comments, questions, concerns? Yeah. 
Thruster? Yeah, Thruster. Are you making Thruster jokes, Stephen? What? I missed that. We're doing squat thrusters? Uh, Luke no. will do it one more time. About you really are out of your mind. So clean. clean to a squat. I thought you had a Thruster joke, but I'm going to mute that because it would be inappropriate. Is everybody ready? I'm going to mute you all again. I hardly know her. Oh, wow. Did you hear what Jackie said? Thruster, I hardly know her. That's messed up, Jackie. <laughs> Here we go. I'm muting you. Inappropriate. We are going in about 10 seconds, so get ready. That's messed up, Jackie. Going in 10. Here we go. So, starting with kick, stand, deadlift. You're going to feel these in your booty tomorrow. Here we go. Kick back. So his front chin is vertical. His heel and toe are lined up. If you're like almost like um, on a railroad track, he's gonna do five of those. And when you stand up, get tight. Once he gets five, he's gonna kick that back leg out and he's gonna squeeze the lats so he can get his upper body swole on. From there, he's gonna bring his front foot up and he rips into a clean position. Every time the kettlebell touches the ground. So it's a dead clean, meaning dead stop from the ground. On his fifth one, he's going to take a deep squat into a press. And that is the thruster. He's doing five. Once he has five, he's going to switch hands. We are 39 seconds in. So we'll switch hands. Kick back to the other side. Five kickstand deadlifts on your non-dominant side, depending where you started. And then five one-arm rows on the other side. you got to get even. That's how Luke hurt his shoulder. He'd never switched hands. Yeah. Then five cleans. So you're going to rip it from the ground to the rack position. Or you can do this with a dumbbell too. We'll show next round with the dumbbell. Once you have five of those, squat into a press five times. Five squat, or I can't talk, five thrusters. From there, hit the deck, sit on your booty, and you're rocking out shin grab sit-ups. So here we go. Lay down, heels touch, shoulders touch, and you are rocking the shin grabs. It's a lot of... So you guys get 30 seconds. 30 seconds. I know Luke said none of you can beat his reps on shin grabs. He's going for 53 reps right now. I'm I, When I demo, you notice I just do one rep of each thing. That's all I got in me. 15 seconds to go. All you need. Does one rep and then goes like this. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty. And then I wonder why people make weird memes about me and shit. Keep going. Five seconds. Three. Two. And you crushed it. it. One nice down. job. Yeah. One down. I'm gonna demonstrate the dumbbell version. How are we doing? Oh, Sadie's throwing high fives. She liked that round. Nice, Sadie. So 45 seconds. We're going round two. How are we doing, everybody? Hopefully you ate a lot of hamburgers and hot dogs and bad food all weekend. Memorial Day. I know I did. Same. I ate almost a whole cake. <laughs> that, was, that was last week for me. What? Catch your breath. 20 seconds. Round two is going to be even better than round one. Oh, Steve and Stacy leave. Oh, yep. There they are. They, they were synchronized when they walked off the workout. So we're going in seven. Get excited. Luke's going to show the dumbbell version of this this time. Three. Two, and go. So you'll notice on dumbbell version, he probably doesn't go all the way to the ground because you don't have as much, or the dumbbell is like shorter than the kettlebell. So five kickstand deadlift, five, 1.5 deadlift. Then you're gonna go five rows, squeeze your back, exhale on top. Once you have five rows, you're gonna bring that back leg up, touch, and rip it right to your shoulder. Rip. If Tom was on here, I would say stand up with it and then curl it for extra biceps, but everybody else just use your hips. Good job, once you have five. On the dumbbell thruster, it connects to your shoulder, squat, and then you fire off your shoulder for five. So we're going five thrusters. Good job. Keep rocking, then switch hands. Kickstand deadlift. Kickstand deadlifts are one of those exercises you do like two of them and your hammies are sore the next day. Parsons, how are you guys still synchronized? This is ridiculous. Good job. Nice, Ruth. So push that back leg. Both toes are pointed forward on those kickstand deadlifts. Good work, good work. Let's visit some other people. 
Here we go. Coming to visit Kevin. Let's go, Kevin. Kevin's got that heavy dumbbell. Kevin, nice. Kevin's got the 75-pound nice. dumbbell. He usually only uses it for curls, but today he's doing a little bit of everything. Once you finish that fifth thruster, hit the deck, and we are shin grabbing. 30 seconds. 30 seconds of shin grabs coming up. Keep rocking. Keep crushing it. Remember, you're trying to beat Luke's number. 20 seconds. Stick with it. You guys got it. This is two rounds done. I see. I Good job, ladies. Let's go, Catherine. Catherine's hiding from the camera. Catherine's oh, she's there. I couldn't see you, Catherine. Yeah, Three, she has a 100 pound dumbbell. Two, five, yeah, it's a strong man dumbbell. Got it. Got it. Good Three, job, everybody. Two down. I'm going to unmute you. It is muggy. How are we loving this one? Is this one better or worse than the first one? Sucks. Real, worse? The parts. Sucks. Oh, a lot of people oh, are giving the thumbs, thumbs down. down yeah. I just want you to know uh, my round was round one. Luke made up this round. So that's why it's worse. Sorry. <laughs> so this round was better then. Oh. I like this round better too. What? I thought Steven would have said all the rounds suck. That's, that's actually pretty positive for you for a, almost Monday. Like when we get the snatches over with. Yes, good to get it done. 15 seconds. We're going round three of five. This is going to be a special round. Round three means you're going to be more than halfway there. It might be harder to operate Zoom than a demo. Here we go. Time starts now. Kickstand deadlift. Lightly touch. Actually, you don't even need to go down all the way. Just go down as low as you can keep your back flat. As long as you don't hit that end meeting button, you're good. I'm not, I almost hit end meeting the other time you let me touch this thing. Then five rows. Saw wood like a lumberjack. Think of your arm as a hook. Move the weight with your lats. Then rip it from the ground. Good job. Five cleans from there. Five thrusters. Wow, that was a, you combined the clean into yeah, a thruster. That was fancy. Squat clean thruster. Yes. Steve, can you do that? That was very dynamic. Good job, then switch hands. Kick the other leg back, kick stand the legs, and squeeze your biscuits, as Eric would say. But don't squeeze your buddy's biscuits. That'd be bad. Nice job, we're about a minute in. Unless you quarantine for 14 days. <laughs> Good job. Five. Rows, five cleans, five thrusters, and then it's shin grab time. Keep crushing it. When you're done, we've got 50 seconds, hit the deck, and shin grab. Good job, everybody. Right now, you've got 35 seconds. Last night, Top Gun was on. Best Ooh. movie ever. Top Gun 2 looks incredible. I know. Is that on hold or is it still shooting? It's got to be on hold. I don't know. Nothing stops. I think it's done, but I don't think they've released it. No quarantine can stop Maverick. No. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, Shin Grabs. You got 15 seconds. Try to get like three or four more, five more. Requesting permission to buzz the tower. <laughs> 10 seconds. Nice Keep rocking. Nice. Five, four, and you made it. Nice work. Three deep. Good job. Shake it out. Nice job. Drink whatever you're drinking. Two more. If Paul was on here, I'd say drink your Tito's, whatever it is you drink. Hopefully, you're just having water. Gatorade. Hornitos. Or Hornitos. Yeah. What is Hornitos? Tequila? Yeah. I think so. I don't do a lot of tequila. Keep rocking. I don't either. <laughs> It's probably been like 10 years since I tried to tequila. 30 seconds. Catch your breath. 15s. Two rounds left. About six minutes. And then we are finishing with a half Murph since most of you skipped it yesterday. 15 seconds. We're going round two. Will the Constances be able to go synchronize this time? Probably yeah, not. Baby works as a weight vest for Murph, by the way. Yep. You can wear a weight vest, Jackie, or you can wear a baby when you do Murph. Your choice. Here we go. Kickstand deadlift. Stick the butt out so all of that motion is in your hips. It's horizontal.
hip motion, meaning you drive your butt back to the wall, butt to the wall, then you kick back, squeeze the lats, exhale on top for five. Once you have five there, square off and rip it from the ground. Good job, rip it into a clean. Good job, on your fifth one, you're gonna squat into a press. So deep squat into a press, it's one seamless motion, so it's a thruster. Good job, once you have five of those, stagger the stance, kick back, drop the bell, and give me five on the other side. You don't wanna have one sexy glute and one non-sexy glute, so you gotta even it out. It's running circles. <laughs> five, the track. five deadlifts. Then five rows, then five cleans. Nice job, everybody. And then five thrusters. You've almost made it. Once you have that, you're doing your second to last set of shin grabs. Made it from here, shin grabs to city. If you don't like shin grabs, sub in your own abs. Your choice, but do something. We got. 35 seconds, so wrap up and then add it out. Good job. There we go, so we're shin grabbing, should be wrapping up and shin grabbing. Got it, Ruth. Got it, Ruth. 20 seconds, hustle up, Let's get those abs, stick with it. Go, Rebecca. Nice, Olivia, good job, Rory. Nice, get to those sit-ups. You got it, nice, we got Rebecca. 10 seconds. Let's go, Chelsea. Rory, good job. Five, four, three. So wherever you are at, wrap it, nice catch your breath, out. take that minute, and think about how you're gonna crush round five. How you doing, Laura? Laura, how you doing today, you good? Good, double thumbs up. Is Patty still outside or is she? Sadie's fired up. Sadie nice is job, always Sadie. fired up. Patty's hiding. Oh, hi, Patty. Welcome. Sadie, you're all fired up for round five, right? Ready to rock? Good. <laughs> so we got 25 seconds. I know a lot of you are a little sad right now. I can sense Chelsea's sadness that round five is coming. Yep, look at those tears. This is the last round of the day. Amanda is also sad. I just want to know how Amanda gets all of her memes. I know. It's like a well it's that would memes. it's like you can't right, mess go. up. Here we go. Time starts now. So five kickstand does. Amanda, it's like you can't mess it up now though. You've got this big streak going and you can't break the streak. Like There's a 90 day streak. I know. It's a, maybe more than that. Yeah. It's a lot of pressure on you right now, Amanda. Kick back and saw wood, five rows. You don't want to mess up the streak. Once you have five rows, slide that back foot up and rip it. Five times, five cleans. From there, five thrusters. And then switch the hands up. You're on the downward stretch here. I don't know if it's my mobility day or Luke's mobility day, but my we'll give you. Day. Yes. Are you going to make yourself do the prisoner stretch? Yeah. <laughs> Good job. Right. Switch hands. Right. All you're doing is Luke's prison yeah. stretch. You're going to sit on your feet for for two hours. Minutes. Good job. Kick that leg back, back, eyes on the horizon, back flat. Once you have five deadlifts, five rows, you are almost there. Stick with it. Good job, good job, good job. Thanks, guys. You have 45 seconds left. Keep Once you're up. done, last thruster. Shin grabs or your favorite abs, whatever ab flare you got. Could be bicycle crunches, V sit, whatever you want, but it's on your butt and it's abs. You got 25 seconds. Finish strong. Good job, good job, good job. 20 seconds. 20 to go. Just don't mimic Luke's, Luke's ab exercises that he's doing right now. It's, it's exhausting. It's a. Modified V set. <laughs> Seven seconds. Just slightly down. Yes. Five seconds. Three, two, and woo! All Good right. job, everybody. I'm unmuting you. 
How awesome was that? You're all unmuted if you want to share anything. Nice job. You guys okay? Grab a drink. We are going to get bendy. You guys stay right down on the floor. I'm going to start you guys with a downward dog. Um, so drive back, hand to the heels. You can pedal the feet out. We're going to go 30 seconds here. Nice job. Try to get your heart rate down. Push your shoulders away from your ears. Hands are forward, fingers are spread, palms are planted. Try to get both hands even. Yep, you'll notice. Yep, dig those heels in like you're pedaling a bike. Good. From there, shift back to your plank. Big step up inside the hands. You're going to drop your knee down. And we're just going to sit the hip forward. So if you guys can, you're going to reach and lean. Open up the front of that hip. And we'll hang out right here. You have jazz fingers on top? Yes. Look at that. Jazz fingers on top. Board. <laughs> Good job. Just open up those tight hip flexors. Good. And then bring the hands back down. Step back. And then step out with the opposite foot. Drop the knee down. And again, raise that hand if you can. And you're just going to lean. Don't raise that hand though if you just had shoulder surgery. <laughs> Push that forward. Don't do anything your doctor would not approve of. Good. We're going to go 15 seconds here. 10 more seconds. Job. You can untuck the back toes and deepen that stretch. And then we're going to come back down to our plank and we're going to pull our knee under. We're going to go right into pigeon stretch. So drop the hip down. And if you guys can, you can either be up nice and tall or you can walk it forward. Ooh. Yep. Cool. Like a pigeon. We're going to go 30 seconds here. <laughs> untuck the back toes. <laughs> Is it weird to throw bird seed while you do this? <laughs> I have a squirrel in my, in my You have a squirrel? I'm going to send my dog over your house. It's, he violently is attacking chipmunks he's in my yard. Down, he's climbing down the side of the house. My daughter was screaming bloody murder because a chipmunk got mangled. All right, then back to your plank, and then we'll go opposite leg in, pull it in, sit the hip back. Like, how do you even catch a chipmunk? <laughs> got to be quick. As far as she can tell, Chip from Chippendale just got eaten. Sink into that pigeon, let your heart rate come down. And then from there, step back. And this time we're going to sit on our knees, untuck your toes, and then drop back. We're going to hang out right here for 30 seconds. This is the worst stretch in the world, right here. <laughs> I think I do this stretch wrong because I don't feel anything. You, you maybe, probably are just way bendier than Luke. Okay. I always do I it. Feel all of it. It's, I am dying. If you can lean back. I know Luke throws uncooked rice under my knees on the hardwood floor when I do it, so it hurts. <laughs> Bad. And then from there, we're going to flip it over. We're going to go flat on our back, pull the knees in, keep the arms out. We're going to stretch out a little bit. So drop the knees over. He shoots a Lego under my kneecap when I do it. It's messed up. And then back to center, switch sides. Hi, Colin. Luke, have a good day. Thanks for joining us today. Happy Tuesday. Yeah, get that low back stretch out. Your low back just got kicked. You still have half Murph coming up yep. after this. Bring the knees back, feet back down to the floor. Cross your left foot over your right knee. And then I want you guys to drop that left foot to the floor. Ooh, fancy one. Yeah, so you should feel it right in the outside of that hip. Put it good. Down. Try to keep the shoulders pinned down, and then you're going to come back to center, cross the right foot over the left knee, and then drop that right foot to the floor. You'll notice one side maybe tighter than the other. Did you just make that one up no, on the fly? No, it looks good. Yeah. Good, then back to center, and then we're going to finish with golf 90-90. So you guys are going to go bottom leg straight, top knee at 90, hands together, and then you're going to take a big inhale. Exhale. Nice. Open up. And you guys are going to give me three per side. So back to center. Big inhale. This is a good one. Big exhale. Yeah. Open up the chest, shoulders, mid back. And then once you guys have three, you'll flip it over. We'll go three on the opposite side. And 
then once you guys have three per side, nice job today. Happy Tuesday. Nice job, everybody. Thanks for Zooming with us. You guys crushed it. <laughs> Tuesday, thank you. Bye. Good to see you guys. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye. Guys. Bye. We'll see you next week. Thanks, guys. See you tomorrow. All right, see yes, tomorrow. sir. Thank you. Good work, everybody.